mark for your team. What were you trying to do on that play, a loose play where you were able to find the ball twice and put it in? I was just trying to work my butt off, just do what I could, um, be scrappy, and just be aggressive and see what would happen. You're one of the players who a lot of people don't think of as an offensive huge goal scorer on this team. Um, but with so many players struggling to find uh, the balls on the connecting end, what were you trying to do in that second half to sort of spark this game? Just try and get girls going, try and be contagious, try to get the energy up, try and spark something so we could get this game, uh, get our scoring done, and uh, just win the game. Um, from 300 feet away, I could tell Coach Sondek wasn't happy with you guys at <laughs> halftime. No. How good did it feel to get that first one and then to sort of breeze through and get win number one in conference play out of the, the way? The first one is always the toughest. Um, once you get that one out of the way, you know, the energy level just goes up and girls, it just kind of, it happens. I don't, I don't, I can't really explain it, but girls just start, you know, putting it together and we start putting goals in the back of the net. You guys got off to a slow start, but three, two, and two, over 500 for the first time. How do you build off of this win into Dartmouth and then into next month? We got to rest up. We got to take care of ourselves and we need to work hard this coming week looking into Dartmouth. We need to practice really hard. We need to pressure each other in practice and um, just really come together as a team and beat Dartmouth with everything we got. It's an important game. We'll turn to Danny now. Danny, you didn't see a lot of time the past two years, but you started off this year two starts and a half of play, completely scoreless. You didn't see a ton of chances, but they had a couple looks late in that first half where if they had gained that 1-0 advantage, it could have gone the other way. What are you trying to do in a game where you're not seeing a ton of action, but you know one goal could be the difference? Um, I'm just staying on my toes, staying in uh, the game with my girls, talking a lot. Um, I don't want to zone out or anything like that. I need to stay in the game, keep my mind in it, uh, make sure we stay, uh, keep their side of the board at zero. So much. It is the momentum starter. We need that confidence to get us going to carry us through for the rest of conference. It means a lot. Um, and then with your team maybe struggling a little bit, what are you trying to say to your back line, say to the rest of the team to keep their confidence as high as it needs to be? Um, that we just need to have, a, they need to keep faith in us and in the backs. The backs need to stay confident. We just need to communicate and uh, trust each other. Thanks so much, guys. The Beacons with a 3-0 victory on Little East Conference opening day. All right.